Wait, that person spoke Cantonese so badly, I don't even know what they said. Oh, there's another thing here. You wanna do the talking? Uh, give me a sec. So this is a health shrine. If we get five, we will get a health upgrade. This is our first one. Alright, let's get money from this guy. What does this guy sell? Watches? Can I have a nice watch? We're collecting for Winston. Winston? Dog guy said he's in charge here. We're here to clarify that. What, you want to be the guy we use to clear up the confusion? I'm not afraid of you guys. <laughs> Don't be a tough guy. Alright, let's show them his boss. <laughs> Pay up. I'm glad I can make you see reason. Take the money, but dog I won't be happy. It's not my business. Alright. So where's Jackie? Oh, he's here. I think you killed him. He'll Good. be fine. He'll just have to drink through a straw for a while. So usually there are things behind the stalls here. Oh, there's nothing over here. Alright then. Where is Jackie? I completely lost him. Whoa, those are very nice bok choys you're selling. We work for Winston. We need to discuss business. Winston? I don't have any business with Winston. Everyone has business with Winston. You're gonna pay up, you understand? Go tell Winston to stick a bok choy up his ass! Hey! Fellas! These jerks are moving in on your territory! Oh? Come on, See. guys! Kick his ass! So because I played this game before, I know that to maximize your score, you want to be hitting them a little bit before you actually kill them and stuff. Oh, Jackie's getting beaten up. Yeah! Bok choy man, pay up! So did you have a message for Winston? He's obviously better than Dog Eyes. Please give him this payment from me. Yeah. And that was really monotone. Please give him this payment from me. I don't need food right now because I actually have full health. Wait, what are those people doing? Hello? <laughs> no beating up old men on our turf. <laughs> oh god. Get this guy, get this guy. Right. Let's see. We drag oh we can bring this guy to the vending machine over here. Let's try that. Get this guy. Let's get this guy. Get over here! Yeah! This guy over to the box over here. Oh! This game is pretty violent. Yeah, Jackie got some guys too. Why was he beating you? He was demanding 20 times the normal payment. Maybe he has a drug habit or something. For a small fee, Winston will make sure you don't have trouble with gangsters. That sounds very reasonable. <laughs> So we saved this guy only to steal money from him. God. We need to get you outfitted. Over here. People need to know you're one of us. We got an image to maintain. Only the best brands. People gotta know you're successful. The clothes make the man, huh? Definitely. It's all about the clothes, man. You know how it is. People judge you by how you look. Well, I think I look better than you though, Jackie. <laughs> so I don't know what the hell you're on. But okay, fine. I don't know how we're getting brand name clothing from this stall in the night market, but I'm not one to argue. Let's buy something. You know, I think he look- I don't think he looks that bad right now. He looks pretty good. What is that? It is the eve of Chinese New Year and cultists- Oh, that's the DLC. Ignore that. So, let's look at some torso. Where's my mouse? Where's my mouse, man? Okay, I'll just use the keyboard for this. Undershirt. 
That's like Jackie's undershirt. Nah, I kind of like the jacket I have right now. Let's change my shoes. My shoes are ugly. Oh, look at those Converse shoes. Let's get them. Come again. <laughs> we get a chain. No, we can't because we don't have face level yet. Face level is basically our reputation. I think we're pretty okay. Why don't we just stick with this right now? Can we don't I need that ugly. In some better clothes? Let's get back to Winston. All right. It's an easy first mission. No, I. It's pretty crowded here. It's nice. Really reminds me of my childhood. Quite a bit. But now. That was awesome, man. All this teen, teen, teen. It's like you were born to do this. Hey, Jackie. Hey, how high? What's going on? Just keeping an eye on things. Yeah? What'd you see? I tell you what I didn't see. He doesn't like me. Nothing to be impressed about. I'm watching you, new guy. You fuck up. What? We're gonna throw down? <laughs> what kind of grade school shit is this, huh? I work my ass off all day, so fuck off and grow up. Jackie! You're coming with me. We got something to take care of. And you! Don't fuck with me. Oh man, he's mad. Alright, so that was our first mission. We have a cop score and a triad score. So cop and triad scores award you with experience towards your next level. Gain levels to purchase new upgrades. I think I remember that... Triad experience is a lot harder to gain than cop experience, so we should really be focusing on that. Because later when we get into the game, there's going to be cop missions as well as triad missions. But cop missions give cop experience, but triad, triad missions only... Triad missions give both. Can you do me a favor? Uh, probably, yeah. What is it? Mrs. Chu sent over some lunch, but I haven't paid yet. Can you take this back to the restaurant? Alright. You might of course. want to hurry. I heard dog guys are sending reinforcement. You should probably be gone before they get here. Oh. Okay. Thanks for the warning. But yeah, I think Mrs. Chu is Winston's mom. Oh my god, food. Okay, this one looks pretty good, kind of, but the ones down here, they look kind of flat. <laughs> oh, this is yummy looking. Fish dumpling skewer. I don't need any of it right now though, so... I'll pass until I get more money. Let's see. Can I start hitting random people here? I- oh my god, I'm so sorry. Oh, here you go. They're not happy with me stealing people's groceries. I better leave. I just stole that lady's bag of groceries. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to hit you. Let's run, let's run. Still following me? No? Okay. Oh, those guys don't look like one of us. Yo! Yo! Want some groceries? Yeah! Gotcha, gotcha! Get you over there! There's, these are one hit KOs. Get you over by the speakers! Ooh! Face meter activated when it glows, you intimidate enemies and regain health. Sounds good. Oh shoot, I wasn't paying attention. Where else can I put you? Oh, put you in the telephone. Nope, you didn't go in. Urgh, get in there. Yeah! Man, this game brings out the violent side of me. Ugh. Get out of here, dog eyes as guys. Don't need any of y'all. That guy. Oh my god, they're all still... They all got up again. I thought that was one hit KO. It's pissing me off. Just get away. Come on. Oh, there's our face meter again. Get this guy. That guy's down. Oh, and they get scared of me too. They don't want to attack me. Oh, I broke his legs. There we go. Beautiful. Alright, let's deliver our money to Mrs. Chu. This is for Susan's lunch. Thanks. All right, that's one mission. <laughs> oh, 
Now we can meet with Winston in the kitchen. Hey, you! Are you shitting me? So what'd you do? Nothing, nothing. Say I the mole. I came straight to you. Didn't want to start anything major, but without you knowing, you know? So get this. A couple years ago, this guy Ming came to me and asked me to look out for him while he did business. Special K mostly, but other stuff too. I thought, why not? I'd take a nice little cut for my boys, no problem. But this week, I sent Jackie here to pick up the envelope, and he tells my boy to fuck off. Apparently, he's friends with Dog Eyes now, so we can all go fuck ourselves. You want me to make an example out of Dog Eyes? That home, Garton, is gonna get what's coming in. Right now, Boy, is I this need Chinese is really bad. Well, that someone is gonna be me. Let's go take care of Ming. For the first few missions, it's gonna be pretty linear and straightforward. They wanna kinda get us used to it first. So. We're just gonna go with that, but later on we're gonna get a little bit more control, then I can start talking more about the game itself. Wow, look at this. It looks like Okonomiyaki or something. Nice chopping, dude. Actually, this is Mrs. Chu, huh? This is Winston's mom. Chicken. Nice- Whoa, nice flat chicken. They literally got this picture off Google Images or something. Damn. Anyways, uh, we're going this way now, I think. Oh, a picture of Winston. Hey, what you guys eating over there? What y'all eating? Oh, ew. <laughs> That's gross. Alright, let's get out of here. I guess this is Winston's wife. I don't know. Wait, it's not Winston's wife. Ask Quan for Ming's whereabouts. Police reports as you progress through the game, you'll unlock new police reports. Use your phone to access them. Oh yeah, we just got the Winston one, right? Let's look at it then. Where is it? Background, Winston Chu, codename Dragon. My main point of contact is Winston Chu, the son on Yi Red Pole who controls, or likes to think he controls, a piece of North Point. As my previous reports have shown, Chu's control is slipping to a competing son on Yi Red Pole. Sam Dog Eyes Lin. Chu is hot headed, impulsive, and not too smart. He lacks any kind of formal education and at times cannot even master street level criminal conspiracies. His temper may be affected by anabolic steroids, which I believe he takes on a regular basis. Chu is ideal as a point of access to the triad. He's ambitious without the brains to achieve his goals and badly needs a smart second in command. This is how I've positioned myself. My quick rise has created jealousy within the Water Street Gang, which is our name, I guess. I am now convinced that suspicions about my true identity are related to this jealousy more than, more than to actual hard evidence. Still, I must be careful that an HQ must keep confidentiality tight at all times. Chu grew up in the old Prosperity Housing Project with numerous Sun On Yi leaders, including Dog Eyes Lin. He seems to have joined the triad at an early age and has now hit the glass ceiling in terms of promotion and power. He will require a substantial reworking of his operations in order to reach par with more accomplished red poles such as Big Smile Lee, Tu Chin Cao, or Broken Nose Jang. A little bit of a read. I might not read it every time, depending on my mood. But you can always skip it if you don't want to read it. Come on. Sun On Yi. That is the name of the our faction of Triad in Hong Kong, and it's actually based off a real one, which is called Sun Yi On, I believe. Later on, there's also another gang in the game called 18K, and I think they're based off another similar gang called 16K or something, I can't remember exactly. But let's see what this guy wants here. Come on, let me show you around. I'm looking for Ming. You know where he's at? Yeah, he just passed the food stand around the corner. All right. Easy enough. You see Ming on the map already. Where is he? Can I see him from here? Hmm. They're around the corner? Oh, there he is, the bald guy. You make it up for me tonight. And we got a deal. Huh? Gross. Ming, I got a message for you. Stop! Do Get back here. Asshole. 
He's an asshole at the same time. I got you. I got you already. I actually have you already. Oh. I'm faster than you. You better run. <laughs> oh god. Oh god. Come on, let me catch you. Coming through. Let me catch you. Bald guy. Get back here. Nothing against bald people, of course. Oh shit! Oh shit! Said the same thing again. Get out of here. Oh, he's so far away now. This game cheats. Oh, the oranges. What are you doing, man? You can mess with me, but don't mess with the. God damn it. Don't mess with the citizens, alright? These people are under my protection. Come on, get back. Oh my god, that shadow. Where is this guy going? What? Break it in. Alright. Guys, to fight. Get this guy. Get Bam. Bam, bam, bam. So you see, every time I hit them, I get like a little bit of triad score. It's not that much, but... I'll need it. Get this, get this. And these environmental ones always give the highest score, so... Gotta be aware of those ones. Are there any more? Nope. Oh, there's a, the, the gate there, the shutters. Let's get the shutters. What? Oh. Put him in the dumpster. Alright. Get in there! And there's Ming. Leave me alone, you fuck! No! It's one of these guys! Oh, he has a knife! That's no good. No matter how good we are at kung fu or whatever, we can't beat an actual knife. Ooh. These counters, sick counters. Ooh. It's a little bit like Batman, Arkham Asylum, and Arkham City. The combat. Let's get this guy. Oh, get over here. Yeah! Get over here! Get this guy. Get him over here. Oh god, that's spinning. That's. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Okay, that's. Oh my god. I hope no kids were scarred by that. <gasps> this is so violent. What am I playing? Oh! That knife almost got me. I got you? Oh! Oh! My god. Nerve wrecking. Hit me! Hit me! There we go. Bam! Ooh! Got you again, Ming. Get the hell out of here. Get him. Kick him while he's down. He's dead? He's gone. Dog guy's gonna kill you. Fuck dog guys. Winston owns this area. You fuck with us and you'll regret it. Okay, okay. But please. Uh oh. Make sure dog guys doesn't kill me. <laughs> Made too big of a scene, way. Fuck. Oh shit, I got caught again. Hey, hey, watch it. Well, that was fast. I literally got out of jail for like Wei-Sheng? one day. I'm Inspector Tang. You have quite a rap sheet here. Multiple arrests in San Francisco, alleged ties to organized crime, and now you're here enforcing for the Sun on Yi. You know, you don't have to throw your life away like this. <laughs> your concern's really moving. Yeah, you know, I appreciate that. I'm suddenly realizing I should have never dropped out of art school. I could have made it. I could have been a real somebody. Thank you for showing me the light, officer. I want to give you a chance, Shen, but you have to work with me. Then maybe I can cut you a deal. Oh, Superintendent, I'm in the middle of an interrogation. Inspector, there's been a misunderstanding. A misunderstanding, sir? As your superior officer, I'm instructing you to release this man. But, sir, I have it so on obvious. record that he's son on Yi. I understand that. I can't simply just cut him loose. I mean, you're asking me to release a criminal with known connections to the triad. And not only is it against well, protocol... for God's sake, Tang, he's one of us. What? Jesus, Pendrew, let me get the door. There are a few badges outside who didn't hear you. <laughs> it's all right, Wei, we can trust her. Trust her? I just met her. Congratulations, Tang, so now you know. Maybe now we can make sure that we're helping Wei, not making his job harder than it already is, hmm? 
Yeah, it doesn't seem like I have much of a choice. No, no, you don't. Now see yourself out. Permission to speak freely. Denied. You need to be more careful, Way. Much more careful. I can't bail you out like this again. Sir, I don't want to hear it. Just be careful. Well, it's good that we got out again. We met a new officer this time. Officer Tang. And we got a house too. Nice. We got 270DX CI report on Sam Dog Eyes Lynn North Point apartment. So yeah, this is the apartment, this really crummy looking apartment right here. And we got five Valve t-shirts for owning whatever games I own. <laughs> Access to Zodiac Island from- oh, that's the DLC. We'll not worry about that for now. DLCs are all separate from the main story, so we can do that afterwards. And I have no idea how I got those either. Rico's outfit from Just Cause 2! Yeah, these are all not- <laughs> These are not part of the base game. <gasps> I didn't know I had that many goodies. American gangs and Asian ones don't compare to the clients. I don't like this cocky little fucker. You need to be more careful, Way. Much more careful. Oh, just a dream. Oh, not a good night of sleep, huh? Don't worry, buddy. Gets better. Okay, so this is our crummy apartment. A crappy looking bed without bed sheets. Crummy looking everything. There's cockroaches on the ground. This is our washroom. Well, since we just woke up, why don't we use the washroom? I think we can actually use the to Oh, God. Oh, God. Yeah, I totally needed to see this. <laughs> Can we also use this to wash our face? Oh! Yes, yes, we should close the blinds before we do any of this. It's not like we live alone or anything. Alright! It's a new day. Let's get started. I don't think- Oh, let's check out the clothing we have. That'd be kind of neat to see what stuff I have already. What is this? Official UFG. That's United Front Games branded t-shirt. Midnight Riders. That's from Left 4 Dead, right? Left 4 Dead. Ella's. Left 4 Dead. Portal. Sa TF2. Aw. This is all from Valve. I don't have any nice pants though. Shoes. Nothing. Hats. What is this from? I don't even... I don't... Uh, yeah. I think these were freebies from the store. Oh my god! Let's see. Oh! Look at this. I don't think we usually have these ones. It might just be because I beat the game already. I don't know. Oh, so this is the one we got for Just Cause 2. But for now... Okay, they actually give a bonus, as you can see there. Improved action hijack. We don't really have action hijack scenes yet. So, for now, I'm gonna stick with this default outfit. Maybe I'll try another one next time. But, uh, is there anything else? Let's see, they press tab to open your map. Okay, so although I said... The... Oops, I accidentally clicked on it. Although I said that the environment looks a lot like Hong Kong, this is not how the Hong Kong map looks like, just so y'all know. We're in North Point, and North Point is actually exactly where I lived in while I was in Hong Kong. So it's a little bit nostalgic. We have a few face missions here. So these are the missions that raise our face level, which lets us wear better clothing. And this is a cop mission because it's blue. And a story progressing mission because it's green. So I think throughout the rest of the game, I'm gonna try to do some face missions and then the cop mission and then maybe some more face missions and then we'll finally do the story progressing mission. It's because the cop missions don't actually progress the story, only the tried missions do. So that's our plan for now. I think I'm gonna go take a little break. This introduction was pretty heavy on the story, so hopefully the next time we come back, 
We're not even going to go out yet. Let's just stay in here. Next time, when we come back, we're going to have a little bit more freedom to do whatever we want. And I'm going to talk a little bit more about maybe Hong Kong or more about the game and whatever else. So, I will see you all next time. Bye-bye!